hi everyone this is your math guru in this video i'm going to show you how to solve the following math puzzle and ultimately find out the value of the red triangle please don't forget to click on the like and subscribe button below for solutions to more math puzzles starting with my first line i have a circle plus another circle equals to 10. using the knowledge of algebra that means i have I replace my circle with a C, so I have one circle, one C, plus another circle, equals to 10. C plus C, that's 2C, equals to 10. So therefore, to find the value of C, I'll use the inverse of multiplication, which is division, by dividing both sides by the coefficient of C, which is 2. So I have 2 into 1, so therefore, the value of C, or the circle, equals 10 divided by 2, that's 5. A quick check is if I have 5 plus 5, that will definitely give me a 10. The next line, I have a circle times a square plus another square. I'm going to rewrite that like I did earlier. My circle, I use C to represent the circle times and the square, I use my S plus S to 12 because I have more than one function I'm going to use board mass or PEMDAS depending on where you're watching this video from I have PEMDAS so that means I have my multiplication coming before my addition so replacing my C I have C the circle equals to 5 times I have my S plus another s equals to 12. so 5 times s starting with multiplication that's 5s plus another s equals to 12 and if i add that together 5s plus 1s that's 6s equals to 12 and so therefore to find the value of s i'll divide both sides by 6. i have 6 and 6 1 so therefore the value of s or the square equals 12 divided by 6, that's 2. So, on the second line, I have my circle, which is 5, and then I have my squares, that's 2 and 2. And a quick check will be 5 times 2, that's 10, 10 plus 2, that's 12. For the next line, I have the circle, that's my C, times my square, square is represented by the variable s, minus the triangle, I'll use t for triangle, times my circle, c, equals to a circle. Now, because I've been able to find the value of my circle and my square, I will replace that, that is, I'm replacing my c, s, and c, and then I'm left with t. So therefore, c, that's the circle, is 5, times my square that's 2 minus t i don't have a value for my triangle yet times 5 that's the value of the circle equals to 5 so i'm going to write that at the bottom i have 5 times 2 minus my t times 5 equals to 5. also using my because i have more than one function using but mass Going to start with my multiplication so therefore i have 10 that's 5 times 2 minus t times 5 that's 5t equals 5. so what i'm going to do is to use the balance method by moving my negative 5t to the right hand side i'll start with that so i have 10 equals 5 plus 5t and then I'm going to move my 5 to the left hand side, that becomes a minus. So therefore, I have 10 minus 5 equals positive 5t. 10 minus 5, that's 5, equals to 5t. And therefore, to find the value of t or the triangle, I'll divide both sides by 5. So therefore, the value of t of the triangle equals 5 divided by 5 that's 1 so therefore my triangle is 1 
and a quick check is if my triangle is 1 on my left hand side I have 5 times 2 that will give me 10 minus on my right hand side 1 times 5 that's 5 10 minus 5 is 5 thanks for watching bye